Warning, the following program contains scenes of graphic stupidity between a man and some games. Don't take anything Android say too serious, I'm just messing around. This video should not be viewed by anyone. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to The Witcher Wild Hunt. Now as we all know, we play as Geralt of Rivia. And throughout the main story of the game, me and Geralt, we fought and defeated the Wild Hunt in order to save Cyrilla. And we did just that, we saved her, and she's not following in Geralt's footsteps. And when it comes to Geralt, he's now living his happily ever after in Tusa alongside Yennefer. But from time to time, me and Geralt, we venture out into the world and we pick up monster contracts. But today we find ourselves in Skellige, and me and Geralt were heading towards a village because word on the street was that that village was taken over by some sort of a threat and the villagers had to flee the village. But as we were heading towards the village, we spotted somebody in the road that was asking for help. What happened to your father? He was cutting wood and a bear attacked him. Show me where it happened. Over here, past the trees. A bear, you say? I'm not hitting any bears. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. It's trap. Really, you little shyster? Where'd you go? Look at him running. What a little creeper. Oh, yeah. There we go. Whoa, nice try. <laughs> Whoa. Come on, you wanna go? What a tramp. Geralt That was badass That little shyster just straight up led me into a trap That's not cool My goodness Alright, so I was actually heading towards Some sort of a village up ahead here uh, This one here I believe we may in fact Be able to liberate it If it's occupied by some bandits or some monsters But that little creeper was like, oh, my pa, he's been attacked by a bear. Turns out, he's part of some sort of a sketchy gang that try and murder me. Showed him. <laughs> Took out his gang. What you gonna do now? Alright, so this is the village that I was heading to initially. So there are settlements around the world that we can liberate, but I don't know if this is one of them. You know, usually the, the villagers are terrorized by the bandos or some sort of a creature and they run away from the village and we can in fact liberate it and if we do so the, the population is going to return. I'm not exactly sure what this is all about here so we're gonna we're gonna investigate. I'm seeing some children. Oh no it's not children it's uh it's bandits It's more band oh okay not your lucky day. Oh yeah. I got shot with the crossbow. Or a bow. Oh my god, Geralt, today we're doing all the executions. Come on. Ooh. Oh he just shot his friend in the back. <laughs> Ow! Okay, I was laughing at his friend and I got I got wrecked. So we can actually... Come on. Ow. We can in fact... Let me show you. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. Let me take care of this guy real fast. So we can deflect the arrows. Check this out. So he's gonna shoot. I'm gonna parry and I can just deflect it right back at him. Die. <laughs> Down he goes. All right, gents. Damn. I gotta say, Geralt, today. 
We have been wrecking people. Come on, boys. Make your choice. Make your choice. All right, I'll make it for you. Oh my god! It's too late to surrender. Come on. Damn. Hey, and there we go. We've liberated the village. <laughs> I didn't expect to find this many bandits today. There you go. Everybody's back at their settlement, safe and sound. Ah, the area is liberated. Its populace has returned, and we got some monies as well for doing the good deed. Which is taking care of the bandits that took over the village by force. I will, sir. I will. I'll get some mead. Oh my goodness, look at that view. Alright, let's see what these guys have on them. Shirt axe. Nothing too crazy. Goat hide, another blunt axe. Were they fighting me with blunt axes? Come on. Ham sandwich. A long sword. Okay, these guys had better equipment. Broken bottle. Linen. No, I, a, a, a couple of good things that we can sell for some um, for some coin. All right, from here we are in fact going to head over here by this uh, by this lake because I want to see what this is all about as well. Uh, maybe it's a monster here or something, and it's a it's a cool looking area by the by the water side. Show me what you got. All right, so oh god. Oh, is that a what is that? Is that a siren? What the bloody hell? So there is a guarded treasure here that we're gonna take a peek at, and I believe oh it's right here. It is a sweet area, look at this. Alright, let's see what we can find here. Flowers, a letter, crowns, and meteorite silver plates. Alright, let me see what this letter is all about. My dearest Master Sigvard, I have received your letter. I just now know that you have a great many doubts regarding the contract I have offered you. And that you clearly suffer from gross misconceptions regarding the nature of a mercenary trade, something which, given that this is a trade you yourself profess to practice, constitutes a highly puzzling paradox. So let me inform you that a mercenary is not paid for asking questions or listing reservations, but for performing a concrete task. This task was described in simple unambiguous words you are to capture a siren alive and bring her to me if you will not perform this task you are of no interest to me as to why i need a siren or what i intend to do with her that should not be of any interest to you if these conditions do not suit you i am sure i will find another man who will not refuse my coin count the button <laughs> um well, he got wrecked. Oh, we have some boots, we have some bear fat, and we have some bear hide. So this guy actually tried to capture a siren and got wrecked. Nicely done. Nicely done, good sir. Good try. Alright, and we have gotten ourselves some boots. Okay, we gotta sell all these to make some monies. What did I get? I got these uh, con condotiers? Con condotiers boots? Oh, they look pretty cool. Not too shabby, not too shabby at all, but I prefer my boots much better. Ah. <laughs> Alright. I have one last spot that I wanna check here by the lake. Uh, there's some ruins that I want to take a look at, see what we can find over there as well. So, we we were ambushed on the road here, then I made my way to the village. This village was taken over by bandits, we liberated the village, 
Then I made my way over here at this small kind of river. And there was a treasure here that we uh, we grabbed, which was some boots, some loot. Uh, that somebody kind of lost, quote unquote lost. <laughs> and now we're gonna head here to these ruins. It's the last part I wanna check today and see what's over there. Alright, so here we are over at the ruins. I've also noticed that over there, I believe it's a um, cockatrice, if I'm not mistaken. He's flying in the back there. He hasn't attacked, so I'm just gonna leave him be for now. I presume there's some sort of a contract on him. We might pick it up later on, but for right now, I wanna check these ruins and see what we can see. Care do. <laughs> All right, let's see what's happening here. Do we have anything interesting that we can uh, yoink? Oh, we have a beautiful enemy over there. Oh, it's in there, isn't it? Oh, God. All right, safety save. Gotta make sure that we save the game here and there because the chances are we might encounter some sketchy enemies. Oh. Oh. Is that what is that over there in the back? Well, Geralt. Oh, it's Neckers! Ah, it's fine. I ain't scared of no Necker. Hello. Hiya! I don't like the Neckers, but they're not scary. <laughs> oh, there is a ton of them. Alright, you know what? Hiya! Come on. You wanna go? Whoa. We'll get the light back in a quick second. Got him. I broke my sword. Come on, you damn knickers. Hold on a second. Inventory. Let me see here. My sword is at 47%. Damn. Alright, let me let me quickly repair this. There we go. Now it's at 100%. I'm also going to repair my, my steel sword. So we have two swords, of course. One is steel. And one is um, one is silver. The silver one is for monsters. Steel one is for humans, as we know. There we go. Oh, lesser brew mutagens. I need I need some mutagens because I'm looking for um, looking for some upgrades here. All right, so. Which way am I? Oh, is this bluff on the ground? Looks like somebody got dragged through here. Oh, it's still going, it's still going. What's happened here? Is this... Did the Neckers do this? I'm just following the blood. I'm gonna. Oh. Come on. Oh, big necker. What the? Uh. I cannot block with the torch in my hand. Ow, ow. There we go. We got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. Look at this. <laughs> oh, no, I didn't catch it. Man, it was like a nice shot of him. Kind of giving up. All right. Right. I don't know where this is gonna lead. <gasps> it led to something. It's a dead body. So this necker, the big necker, I believe, just dragged this poor man in the dungeon. Alchemist key and letter from the alchemist. Alright, I'm not going to take you through all of these. I'm going to read it to myself and quickly tell you what this is all about. Alright, so pretty much what I gather from this letter is that somebody disappeared. Somebody's son disappeared on a voyage. And near the place where he disappeared, uh, there were some Neckers lurking around. And it was believed that this disappeared son transformed into a Necker. And pretty much uh, what the rest here says that it's not exactly possible to do that. But if somebody could dispel it... That'd be great as well. But we did get a key.
All right, so we've unlocked this here chest with the key that we found and we have a sword we have a saddle We have money and a bunch of other things. Uh, this is the key that we got from the dead body in there I believe What are we having oh my god Well, there is more people here that got wrecked by something by the neckers probably And we have a dead soldier. What has happened in this bloody... It's a cage? What's happened in these ruins, man? Nothing good. So many dead people here. Crumpled letter. Dear sir, you are kind enough to share with me your doubts concerning the contract. You made it clear you believe it is impossible for a man to turn into a necker. So this is refer referencing the other letter that we took a look. Uh, a look at. You ever drove the point home with a humorous comparison saying I believe same as a pig won't turn into a horse not even if you strap a saddle on it and call it black <laughs> black beauty what the hell. Uh, it is entirely possible uh, that you are right but if there exists even the shadow of a chance that my son has been imprisoned in the body of that monster that some spell of course has done this to him then i will not rest until i try every possible way of helping him that is why i would ask you to refrain from further attempts at humor and keep your doubts to yourself instead channel those energies towards doing the job for which you shall be paid catch the necker and collect your gold the rest should not interest you respectfully yours Robert, er, Robert, 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 Demer, 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 I, Robert. <laughs> so Robert believed that his son was turned into a necker and he sent some people here trying to catch said necker and they are all dead. These guys are dead, the guy back there is dead. There's a cage here, so I'm presuming they tried to capture it or they did capture it and it escaped. We did find a sketchy looking necker, so I'm presuming that he thought that that necker was his son somehow. But yeah, let's see if we can get out of here. It doesn't look like there is a necker here that we can help, pretty much. I'm not hearing any monsters. Um, we followed the bluff over there, so... It could be that one of these guys is the necker that the father presumed his son turned into, but I'm sure Geralt would be like, that's not possible. And it looks like we have a bit of a monster up here as well. It's a werewolf! Where'd this guy come from? Hello. Holy crap. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right. It's a sketchy looking werewolf. What kind of werewolf is this? Did I just miss that? Oh my goodness. Oh. I didn't miss that, did I? Come on. Oh my god, just wrecked me. Okay, okay, okay. It's time. Hi. Don't be growling at me, sir. Oh my goodness. Let me try to do oh, okay. Bro my shield, bro my shield, bro my shield. Oh, is it possible that this is the sun? Oh my god! He was turning into a werewolf, maybe? Come on. 
Where are you going? Oh, this is a strong werewolf, let me tell ya. He's doing very well when it comes to dodging my blows as well. Look at him. Bro, my shield. Don't worry, I got another one. There we go. Alright, this werewolf was, uh, was pretty powerful. Let me see here. Werewolf mutagens. Dust and whatnot. My goodness. Could it be possible that the werewolf killed those guys inside? Oh. Oh, legendary griffin, a silver sword, master crafted. I have all the sets, so I don't exactly need these because this is a new game plus. So I have all the cool armors and swords and, thing like, and things like that. Alright, but uh, that's the last place I wanted to check out. That was pretty cool. A pretty cool, like, uh, what do we call this? Dungeon? <laughs> it was a cool ruin where we found out some things that some people were sending there to look for a necker and capture a necker, but they were they all got wrecked because some guy thought that his son was turned into a necker. Hey, look, it's the cockatrice. It's still there. I'm not gonna fight it. I'm just gonna leave it be. There you go, I'm gonna go and sell the things that we've gotten today. We've gotten a bunch of things. If I do say so myself. Look at this. We gotta sell all these. All these things that we've got. We got some armor as well. Looks terrible. Look at this. <laughs> I mean, look at this. And then look at this. I mean, come on. But yeah, there you go. That's about it for right now in The Witcher. I'm gonna go sell all these and make some more monies. And probably craft a couple of things like some I'm, I'm trying to craft some um, some bolts some explosive bolts and I'm also trying to craft some uh, some mutagens some green ones so I can so I can consume more potions I'm trying to go here and I need one more greater green mutagen so I can activate this as well and then I'm gonna I'm gonna unlock one of these and I can put uh, one of one of these here so I can consume more potions without my toxicity going way too up. But that is about it for right now in The Witcher. I hope everybody enjoyed. In case you did, be sure to drop some stuff and things down below. Be sure to subscribe. Thanks so much for taking the time and hanging out. And I will see you in the next one with some more video games.